for weeks now. He claims that no rules were broken. He claims he didn't know what was happening in his own house last Christmas. I don't believe him. His MPs don't believe him, and nor do the British public. He's taking the public for fools, and it's becoming dangerous. Because from today, anyone who tests positive for coronavirus faces a second Christmas in isolation. It will be heartbreaking for families across the country. The message from the government has to be, we know that following the rules won't be easy this Christmas, but it is necessary. Can the Prime Minister not see that he has no hope of regaining the moral authority to deliver that difficult message if he cannot be straight with the British public about the rule breaking in Downing Street last Christmas? Uh, Mr Speaker, I've repeatedly answered uh, that question uh, before. And, and, uh, and as he knows, a report is being uh, delivered uh, to me by the Cabinet Secretary into exactly uh, what went on. He might explain why there are pictures of him uh, quaffing beer, uh, Mr. Speaker. Uh, uh, we have, uh, uh, in a way, I mean, I, we haven't heard. We haven't, I think what the British public want us all to do, frankly, and what they want us all to do is focus on, focus on the matter in hand. 